we speak of a race meeting at Brooklands, we naturally look for speed. We think of cars lapping at about 100 miles an hour. On this occasion, the last of the National Cyclists' Union trials, though there was nothing like these car speeds, the 99 starters put up a really wonderful performance. The total length of the course is about 67 miles, 18 laps, a feat requiring not only speed, but stamina. Nearly all the well-known cycling clubs in the country were represented, and so consistent was the class of these wheelers that there was no appreciable thinning out. Pedalling for nearly 70 miles is strenuous work, but they all stuck it like heroes. Percy Wilde of Derby finished first to P. Stallard and C. Holland, with Harville fourth. It was generally expected that Wilde would finish first. He's already many notable victories to his credit. And here's the winner, looking very little the worse for his long and difficult performance.